I'm still with Sarah Tagawira, a phenomenal woman, as she, she narrates her testimony to help change your life. Now, Sarah, I understand, like they say, once beaten, twice shy. Do you think you can still love again? Do you think you can still accommodate someone after what you've, what you've gone through? Yes, life is to move on. And I'm happy now that I made a decision and I'm actually in a relationship now. And I'm happy now, I'm in love now, and life is moving on. Okay, fine, let's say you're in a room full of women who have gone through exactly the same thing that you've gone through. What could be your advice? What could be your advice? What, what, what words of advice would you give for them? Well, I want to say to the people that have been broken, pick up the pieces. You have to pick up the pieces, you have to rebuild yourself again, you have to start again. You have to face life, you have to try again to love, try again to live a normal life. Because at the end of the day, it's you. You and one who lose your pain. Maybe sometimes the person is moved on, his life is moving. You have to be strong and brave and tell yourself that I, I, I can do better, I can live again, I can love again. Because this is your life. Not the people that are there. In as much as we care, but the pain, it's you who's feeling the pain. It's you who's on fire. So it's your decision to still live an abusive life or to move on with your life. Because you only live once in life. So look at yourself, you are a star. Tell yourself I'm beautiful. Tell yourself I can move on. Tell yourself as long as I'm alive, I'm not out. I'm not down and out. That's you have to stand the ground. Okay, that's, that's the spirit that we, we, we want and that's the spirit that we expect every citizen and every Zimbabwean, every woman who's listening to have. Whenever you hit your rock bottom, the only way to go is the way up. It's you, you need to make that decision. Your real character, that's when your real character is born. When you make that decision, do you know what? It's either or I have to pick myself up. Okay, let's just dive in a little bit. How's been your 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 your, your acting career career after that? How 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 are you enjoying your life now? Uh, I want to thank God because after that, it was not easy. The process wasn't easy. The healing process wasn't easy, but I had to go through the process for me to help. Yeah, there were times I used to cry. There were times I tried to kill myself. There was a time. I, I could not face the world. I could feel like I feel like what will the people say? What do the world say? Mm. More worse still because I go to church. People will look at you and say, Inga no namata, Inga she's a pastor. Mm. So how come she's experienced in mm, mm, mm. The world will start judging you. Mm. But I thank God because I get a brave to say, no, look, this is my life. Mm, mm. Yes, I have to be brave and start again. So I, 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 I then went back to film mm. and I started doing films. I started enjoying life again. I met this guy, I'm happy, I'm now in love. Things started moving well. But back then it wasn't as easy as, as I'm, like the way I'm saying it now. All right, okay. Yeah. Uh, just concentrating a little bit on 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 your on your acting career i i've i've had fun uh watching you uh do what you you do i i i i enjoy watching you because you're a phenomenal personality one 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 point you're very we are this very uh funny character i never knew of that side of you so how 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 did that help you heal uh, and forget all this past life that you've lived and and come to where you are today. Well, and I believe good a punishment like this, a good change on It makes you heal because you do something that you want to do. You, you're doing something. I enjoy film. I enjoy shooting. Like that is what I say in my life. I enjoy shooting. I enjoy ministering the word of God at church. So it it made me to heal. And each time I, I'm doing it, I feel good. Uh, there are people out there who love me. There are people out there who support me. There are people out there who I'm inspiring by being an actress. There are people out there who wake up every morning looking forward to see me on TV. And that made me to do it and wholeheartedly and 
helped me to help. Okay, fine. If I wouldn't say if your last words was you're not dying, I want you to to leave me a tagline. What those words? No, what could be your inspirational words that you want you you you'd, you'd leave? I want to say to the people: Don't you ever feel the other people are better than you? You can be the best. Don't you ever look down upon yourself? Don't you ever feel maybe I failed in life or I'm nothing I can do? You can do anything. The word of God says you can do anything through Christ who strengthens us. <laughs> so anything is possible as long as you focus, as long as you tell yourself, in, in, I, I believe good decision making, to tell yourself that enough is enough, I want to do this. Enough is enough, I have to move on. Enough is enough, I want to do this, I want to do this. I want to do this and you make it in life. And then I told myself I want to act and I'm doing it. And I told myself I want to preach the word of God and I'm preaching the word of God. Irregardless of my past, irregardless of what people are saying about me or how people see me. Mm, mm, mm. But I, I, I am living that and I'm happy. Thank you so much, Sarah, for your life testimony. They say, they say uh, experience is the best teacher. I would have never known this other side of you had you not taken the bold step to, of sharing your life testimony with the rest of the nation. Thank you so much once again for, 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 for allowing uh, me to expose you like that at the same time we uh, helping lives. Thank you, Zimbabwe. I, I was with uh, Sarah Takawira as she narrated her story. Her story can help change your life. Her story can help change your situation. Mm -hmm.